Pod 2 offline. Main reactor operation temperature exceeding safe levels. Marine, Bravo team is down. Its operational status is unknown. They were carrying a military transmission card. It's vital you retrieve that card as it contains encoded data needed to send the distress signal to the fleet. You're the last hope to get reinforcements. Find that card and find it fast. safety violation. As I've stated repeatedly, our service manuals must be followed to the letter. Now this includes Gas changing back stop. filters for the cooling Fire system on the schedule and not when maintenance gets around to. As you know, unclean back filters will create pressure inside the cooling system's release tube. Even a minor disruption in a release tube can dislodge or destroy its coolant rod, overheating the core, and possibly sending the entire facility up in smoke. Let me be clear. Do this again, the team responsible will be transferred to sewage treatment before the day is over. for the info facility. I appreciate UAC's concerns following the number of stress-related illnesses spreading throughout the base. However, I don't understand why we require such a large detail of armed security boxing in front us. Now, you may disagree, but I trust my team's mental condition far more than whatever programming is running inside those bots. Which brings me to the reason for this report. Today, one of my best engineers, Patrick Thomas, was nearly shot when a bot was to clear. That's right, shot. Luckily, a nearby team from maintenance caught up to it and smashed it with a pipe wrench before it could chase Pat down. Now, it'll be days before he's ready to return to work, and I don't think you'll ever get him close to one of those bots again. Our jobs are difficult enough without needing to avoid getting shot. We're going to be treated like prisoners. I respectfully request that you afford us the courtesy of being guarded by people instead of
reactor operation temperature exceeding safe levels. This is the audio log of weapon analyst Teresa Chazar, dated November 3rd, 2145. I'm pleased to report that the preliminary tests on the ammo storage in the new Mach 3 plasma gun has far exceeded our expectations. We realized a full 50% gain in the storage capacity of ammo packs as a result of utilizing techniques engineered in the Alpha Lab's molecular compactor. I believe with the ongoing compaction research, we will reach our goal of three times the plasma storage currently available in standard ammo packs. I would also like to mention that all of the employees here at the NPRO plant have been very helpful and quite eager to accommodate all of my requests. For security reasons, I've locked the plasma gun and the extra ammo in locker 063 with door code 972. End of lock. Reactor core temperature beyond acceptable. 
find that transmission car. Swan gets his hands on it. You know what he'll do. Online. 